Today is all about friends. In 1998, the United Nations made Winnie the Pooh the world ambassador of friendship. Then in 2011, the UN officially made July 30th the International Day of Friendship. And as we get older, it sometimes gets harder to make new friends. You're busy with family and children. You don't have much time to spare. Well, friendships are very important, especially for your mental health. So in today's Mommy Matters, five ways to make new friends. First of all, try a community class. Maybe you've always wanted to try making pottery or painting or cooking. You can check out some of the classes being offered at your local community college. You'll meet people with similar interests who may become good friends. Also, try volunteering for something you feel very passionate about. You'll not only spend time doing something you enjoy, but also you'll meet others who are like-minded. Another great idea, a parenting group. Many schools and churches have them. It's a good way to connect with other parents and find people who share your interests. You might consider a book club or other interest group that brings people together over a shared interest and make friends with people at the gym or in a fitness group. You can work out together, then maybe step out for some coffee. It can be kind of tough to step out of your comfort zone and meet somebody new, but it all starts with the word hello. Remember, you don't have to have an in-depth conversation on the very first day. Just break the ice, ask questions, and listen to what a new potential friend says. Then you can decide if you want to pursue a real friendship.